my name is Jolene Andrew. I'm Get Sanwat Sudin uh, from northern, north central BC. I, I care about climate change because I can see the change in the land and the worry uh, that my own community faces when it comes to infrastructure planning that wants to disrupt um, our traditional territory and our food system. So to me, that's a priority is to support the work that's being done to protect our waterways and, and protect our food system so that we can continue on being resilient in the future. The rivers are starting to flow different. Um, the water levels um, aren't reaching the levels that they have historically. So that affects our salmon and our, their ability to reach our communities, but also affects the ability for community members to use those traditional highways to get to their food sources that they have a right to. We don't even benefit from picking our own berries anymore. I remember when I was young, we would get truckloads, like truckloads of berries and have enough for it to feed the forest still and to feed our people for the year. A lot of times people will talk about, um, you know, obesity and diabetes. Um, and other health impacts that Indigenous communities are facing, but and, and they want to teach us about nutrition, but they don't redress what happened to our food system, what happened to our food sources. So um, that goes unchecked. I think Indigenous knowledge and the people who have knowledge of the land are the ones that um, really witness the deep changes and they're the ones that are listening to the animals and can see the changes in, in migration and changes in the health of the animals. So not only will we witness and have a deep attachment and, and sense of what goes on in those places, uh, we should be the ones leading and taking care of it.